Well, I think our local delegation is could be doing better in being more aggressive in passing laws that shrink the size of government and lower our taxes. Um, I'm a firm believer of that invisible hand that Adam Smith described, which essentially is the hand that drives the private sector. Problem is that this is an election year, and the legislature is tainted and perhaps hampered by some of the rigors of the election process. So uh, we have um, an, a time this year when perhaps the legislature is not being as aggressive as it could be. As far as um, the things they're doing right, I'm glad that they are working hard to maintain the stand your ground legislation. I'm very pleased with that. I'm glad to have seen the legislation that they're um, promoting about um, allowing you to, to carry your pistols away during a time of an emergency. I also like the legislation about the warning shots uh, regarding our Second Amendment rights. Um, I also am very pleased to see the legislature uh, maintain the, not, not act to further common core, which is something that I think we need to, we need to uh, fight against. If you'll recall, at the beginning of the legislative season, Common Core looked like it was going to be a, a very big agenda that was going to be promoted. Um, Medicaid expansion was stopped this year. I think that's good. I'm glad to be, I'm looking forward to being a part of the legislature next year when they tackle that. Um, so there are a lot of things that the legislature has decided to do uh, this year and has decided not to do this year that I think are very positive actions. Um, but in general, anytime the legislature works to protect our rights and to foster our abilities to promote our ideas and take them to the market, that's something that I am very happy to see the legislature do.